All right, here we are out for another day getting some wood. Going out to get some wood, first thing we have to do is pick up the trailer, of course. So, all right, let's see how he does. All right. Keep coming. Keep coming. All right. Straight back, three foot, two foot, one foot, stop. Thank you, good to go. Yeah, so here we are back where we're gonna get a couple of trees. We got these two guys here behind me. Uh, we're gonna take those guys down. Me and good old Grandpa Dale back there. Say hi, Dale. So we'll see how this goes. We'll give it a good try. So here's one of them we're bringing down today. Fairly what tall. Pull out about three feet. <laughs> yeah. And the problem is that we have a fence over here to the neighbor guy's field, and the tree is leaning that way. If we do a really deep way. undercut, we might be able to... So we're going to deeply undercut it, yeah. put some chains on it, hopefully to that big tree over there, and uh, pull it over and drop it right there for yeah. us. Anything else, we'll have to fix a fence. And then this one here is also leaning the wrong way, and we're... Badly. Going to have to pull that one over that way is also to the big tree over there. So, we're going to grab a couple chains. Stuff out of our trailer. We one got a ladder. Was We have to try to pull that chain as tight as we can before we start jacking it. Yeah. Because if we can only pull at, what, four, four, four feet? And we'll use up a foot just getting it tight. Oh, yeah, it's going to be tough. Tight, yeah. yeah. See you later, tree. We're about to start the undercut. Uh, Dale's gonna take over from here on the videoing for me because I gotta concentrate on the tree. I don't wanna do anything else but watch where this thing is going, especially since it's leaning the wrong way. So we'll see how this turns out in the end. Timber! So, we've got the chain on that tree over there. We've got it ran up pretty far up on this tree. Use the ladder, get up there and wrap it around. Got the come along set. We've moved the vehicle to a safe distance. We have the chainsaw warming up. Now, this was a black match that I got at Walmart. It, uh, it was on clearance for $40. It actually came with an 18 inch blade. It was too much blade for the saw. I reduced it to the 16, which I got on sale at Walmart for like four bucks with the blade or something. It was insane. So, we're going to see how it does today. We're going to take some video of it our first order of business move the ladder and make the undercut all right so we got the two trees all chopped up gonna, yeah we got this area of piles of wood over here now so we got this area cleaned see how it goes there was a lot of wood in this area oh yeah what do you say total cords we got out of this little square what, back five? here five yeah probably five already at least and then just a little scraps around it's probably another two cords just laying in scrap Little well, we branches. Got some down over there too. We got some over there to get. So we got a lot more to go. Yeah. What do you have here? What do you got, Bella? Is that my bone? Get my bone. Get my bone. That's my bone. Oh, you're such a mean puppy. Ooh. So we got uh, all this down out here. Oh, a few here. Got another good pile here. Now we did these logs. A little bit skinnier. We usually go closer to 16 inches. These are closer to 12. So we've got all of them stacked up, lined up, and ready for pickup. So now we just got to get them back to the house. And him too. I gotta take that guy down over there yet. Yeah, he's dying. So there was a whole bunch of them over here. We dropped and got rid of them. Now we'll let it all go back to natural and grow some more new trees. 
been out getting wood all day. Just bringing loads in, and then we got some more stacked up. We got a hanger there. We're going to see what happens. It was, yeah, it stayed so far. It was leaning on the trailer a little bit. We figured it would fall over when we pull it out. So, yeah, I got all oh, this. Of course, all of it's got to be split over here still. They got some more over here. And, of course, it's the front of the cabin. Real nice. Finally got some grass this year. So, that was real nice. Got a sail with some grass. All this under here is bark. So, just tons of bark. Cheap, easy BTUs. And this is my little wood stacking area for putting wood up in. And of course, I have a wood splitting area and a splitter. Are you on channel one? Who are you talking to? Ma'am, I am currently making a video for the YouTube channel. <laughs> so that was Wendy messing with me on my walkie talkie. She can see me. Yeah. She's hiding back in the Back in the woods back there somewhere. Where you at? I can't see you. She's hiding in there somewhere. Putting away all of her gardening and spring, summer stuff. Another beautiful sunset here at the ranch. Just heading in for the evening. It's got the chickens put away. And walked around for a little while. Didn't see any deer, but lots of tracks. Possibly a coyote, so... We're going to go relax and enjoy the rest of the evening. Maybe cook some pork chops with bacon wrapped around.